With the release of Panasonic's new GH5S, the Lumix G series lineup, including the GH5 and G9, comes full circle. All three cameras share the features of 225 focus points, dual SD card slots, and a focus point joystick. Beyond these details, however, the bodies are tailored towards very specific workflows and user needs. The newly released GH5S, for example, is a filmmaker's dream, specializing in everything video and making few concessions for anything else. It features a 10 megapixel 4 3rd sensor for extreme low light capabilities, in camera 10 bit 422 file format recording, the ability to shoot 60 frames per second at 4K for slow motion and 240 frames per second at standard HD for extreme slow motion. Oh, and don't forget, it completely lacks a recording time limit. Additionally, this body includes features such as time code in and out for syncing multiple cameras, V-Log and 4K HDR recording modes, as well as full-size HDMI out for an external monitor or recording device. For the photo specialist, the Lumix G9 is the obvious choice featuring a 20 megapixel 4 3rd sensor with the ability to create an 80 megapixel image by stacking eight sequential images that are shifted a half pixel apart from each other. This feature coupled with the lack of a low pass filter allows for stunning detail and image quality. Speed is also a killer feature of the G9 body. You'll never miss a shot with its ability to shoot up to 20 12-bit raw images per second. For the hybrid producer, the individual shooting both stills and video, the Lumix GH5 is an excellent choice, creating the perfect balance between the video functionality of the GH5S and the high-resolution capability of the G9. The core of the GH5 features a 20-megapixel 4 3rd sensor with no low-pass filter and 5-axis in-body image stabilization. The video capabilities are equally stunning, featuring Cinema 4K, which is both wider and higher resolution than standard 4K, internal anamorphic video mode, which allows anamorphic lenses to be used for a more cinematic look, slow motion at 4K, and ultra slow motion at standard 1080p. One of the most impressive video features of the GH5 is its ability to shoot 10-bit 422 in-camera, which is four times the color information of an 8-bit capture, allowing for better gradations and tonality. In a side-by-side -side comparison, we see many shared features. However, the Lumix G series draws very clear distinctions dependent on its end user. We have the video-centric line, the high-resolution line, and the hybrid line, featuring a solid mix between the two. All three bodies are at the store, so come on down to PictureLine and give each camera a test drive to see which body best suits your needs.